Ah, the sweet sound of Hoku. It's been 15 years since we first heard that frosty theme from Snow Day. E.T. hung out with the cast back in 2000. Snow Day, Snow Day, Snow Day, Snow Day. Anything can happen, Hal. School is cool, but you know, everybody's looking for that yeah. Snow Day. But this is my first um, movie and it couldn't have been better. I mean, to sum up Snow Day in three words, wet, cold, and fun. Chevy Chase was the resident meteorologist and had a few snow day tricks up his sleeve. When I was going to Riverdale in New York, uh, we took a couple of buckets of uh, water. Uh, we knew it was going to be way below freezing. And just uh, and Riverdale was the top of the hill. We just uh, poured them all over the driveway. And the next morning, the buses couldn't get up because of the frozen tundra. I gave him a couple comedy pointers. <laughs> but I learned a lot from him, actually. He's really funny. Yeah. And he's... And he's Got a good arm. He threw a oh, couple yeah. good snowballs at us. <laughs> I don't see any us here. <laughs> All I see is a whiny little runt who's going back to school tomorrow. Oh, that's too bad, huh? But the ultimate snow day was threatened to end by every kid's nightmare, the snowplow man. It's funny because the film actually initially in the script, there was a, a, a sort of an arc to the character where he actually turns and becomes kind of nice at the end of the film. And uh, uh, we shot it, but um, uh, evidently, um, you know, in, in editing it, um, you know, it just uh, didn't make it. Um, so I, I end up being the bad guy all the way through the film. Snow day, snow day, snow day.